one this is such a weird setup to me uh, I look so white in that anyway I have been asked to do a makeup tutorial thing of how I just do my makeup um if you have watched my last one you know I'm not the best at makeup but we just vibe with it so I'm just going to take you through everything I do everything I use and show my face to be honest it's not really what I do um I'm not the best I just smack it on to be honest so first I use a Smashbox primer um I never used to see the difference but I use this and it really does minimize your pores and I think it helps stay on all day so use it <laughs> I'm looking like behind the cameras because my mirror is behind the camera so it's not because I'm being weird then oh my god this is vile but we're just, we're just gonna pretend it's not that dirty I got a beauty blender I use the oh that's a fact I bought a new one yesterday oh well then I use a studio fix fluid by MAC so this it's real strong cover I'm not gonna lie normally hello why is it not working normally use two oh my god so it's literally I haven't used this one before we've got a new um <clears throat> Any bottle, so I put way too much on. Under the chin, cool, cool, cool. And then I just dab it in until it looks kind of like perfect. I kind of need to go closer for this. darker in there i look white in there <clears throat> but okay then whoa when i think that's kind of like blended i use a tart tape shape it's so annoying you can't buy this in the uk i bought this when i went to berlin at december and it's it's nearly july and it's still going strong it cost me like 25 pounds i want to say but one I, I literally just use this sometimes without foundation it's so good um it's really full coverage and I don't think it's really that much money for how long like I've been using it for you know normally it's put under my eyes on my spots and on my chin I don't really know I just started doing that well no I started doing that because I had spots on my chin and I just kept doing that because I still kind of have spots on my chin and then again just blend <laughs> you can see like i don't know if you can see it like white patches oh there's one in my house uh then i go in with the mac studio fix um powder i think this one's nc25 and the other one's nc my foundation's nc20 but uh we vibe we just go with it and then i just put this like everywhere especially where i put like the, my um concealer because it does go white and then this kind of fixes it i put it under my eyes because I um sweat not sweat but oh I've missed a spot I've only just started baking like the past two days but I do think it makes a, a difference so I use um a different beauty blend I bought this one by accident but then this powder one but I just use it and then I use revolution bake and finish um mm, then I just oh god so I get this everywhere every time okay I don't even know if I do this right I just shove it on I put it under my eyes. I I have noticed it worked because I get really like greasy under my eyes and like I always have to put powder on it, but I've noticed since I've started baking this kind of stops it. Okay, cool. Got a cup of tea in the corner, not gonna lie. Don't judge me, okay? I've probably I had a Tanya bar um eye kit and i still use the brush on it even though i i've had other ones which doesn't do the same and i've got a broken spoolie thing and then i use the um pomade beverly hills pomade and i use the, uh, the color granite <clears throat> yeah it's like really dark but we vibe so i just kind of brush these out and then i just um shove it on <laughs>
side with it and then I just brush it out again just to make sure like no clumps are left in it. Why is it so uneven? I hate doing eyebrows. Oh my god. Then I just get my brush and just brush this off. I don't want to leave it for too long because it's going to look really white. It's like a fit. Oh, my storage. And then I just get the yeah, soft and gentle MAC highlighter. I'm not going to lie, I shove my finger in. Put it under the brow bone arch thing. Oh my god. I don't know if I'm putting loads on properly. And then I just put it in the corner of my eyes as well. Cool, and then here. Cool. <laughs> then I go in with my eyebrow, eyelash, what's it called? Eyelash curl, let's curl them. Supposed to do one eye at a time, and then I get my <clears throat> 3D lash by Rimmel London. And I have used so many mascaras, and I think this is the best one for generally making your eyebrow eyelashes longer. And it's only a five, so it's not going to go long. And then go under the eyelashes. Now I've done that. I don't actually know what this is, so let me try and find out. Man Manacada. I got it in my birch box, but I think it's really good to like add like make them thicker. Like if I show you before, like just with the 3D lash, and then I'll show you the after. And that's the after. I think you can tell I look a bit thicker. And I'm just going to do the other eye and then I'll be back. Now we're getting to the end of the routine. Use my uh bronzing brush this i swear this one was just from super drug and i've had it for like four years i rate it then i go in with the hula bronzer i never used to use this but i had anastasia beverly when i used to swear by it but then i think because i probably had about three years like and it stopped doing its job so it's like i'm really patchy so then i got this and it works really well so yeah normally i kind of go focus on the brow bone but i also come bring it down by my mouth you can see kind of the natural line and then i go up here as well um, I don't know why, I just think it makes my face look thinner. I'm do the same on the other side. Then we go onto the forehead. Just shove it on again, to be honest. Under the chin. Get you a chiseled jawbone. I don't know what I was watching. I think it's on Cosmo Person, but they said J-Lo, to get J-Lo's like jawbone, they basically always brush it away. That's what I do because I'm like, I want to look like J-Lo, you know? Okay, this side. Cool, cool, cool. Then I got the James Charles brushes. I just use this um, E62. <laughs> Dip in the same thing and just try and start in the middle because I've noticed like you don't want to, because it's got the most amount of product on, you don't want to start, you know, at the top of the, the thing. And then I just kind of shove it on. I don't really know what I do, but I just do it. Yeah, and then I just look at it and think, that'll do. And then I just blend this out a bit because you don't want it like super, super strong, but you do want it there, you know? Oh, these are just the real techniques, neat brushes if you were, were wondering. Yeah. And then I get a different brush, but it's the same as the contour brush, but different. And dip into my highlight again, my MAC one. And then I just shove it here down the nose but I try and be more like careful where I place it and then on here wherever that's called the cupid's bow get the contour brush dip into mac dolly mix can you even see that because I can only see half me and then just dip in it well oh god I just put that on the nose don't really know why oh. I don't know if you can see how my dust gone, but I've gone so pink. Okay, we, we just wrap up with that. That's cool. And then, this is what this product is. I've got it again in my birch box, but I just use it to go underneath, like, on my lips before I put lipstick on because I'd be dry. I have dry lips. Depend I have three colours I either use. I either use this Barry M red one that you might have seen me wear, a red lipstick, or this Smashbox uh one and i don't know what color it is oh stepping out that one's a lot like darker well not a lot darker but then i my uh favorite one is this mac one it's called burnt spice i'm gonna use this it doesn't go together but i just use it anyway uh it's in the color lip pencil mac it's in the color saw and i just kind of like draw my lips on i really sharp it's actually 
That actually kind of hurts. <laughs> Get that gone. Uh, no. Okay. This is the thing I'm worst at is lips. I can't do lips to save my life. And then I just kind of put this on. <laughs> So you can see how really bad I am at doing that. And I just spray. Wow. Beauty girl. <laughs> so that is literally all I do. And then I'll either top up my lipstick or I will powder throughout the day. That is literally all I will do. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Please like and subscribe. Comment what you want to see from me. Go follow my Instagram. I'll link that. Well, kind of linked it. I don't know how to link it, but I've wrote my name down below. And my TikTok. Thank you so much. Bye.